We are often warned that robots will take over many of our jobs because they're faster, more accurate, and more affordable. But no robot will replace these people. They're just too good. From a man who can dice watermelons at lightning speed to the world's fastest painter, here are 20 fast workers who do unreal things. Number 20. Lumberjacks Lumberjacks, woodcutters, loggers, whatever you call them, there's no denying they've been valuable and skilled people for centuries. Professional lumberjacks became commonplace during the early 18th century, and it was known as a back-breaking, labor-intensive job in some quite challenging and hazardous working conditions. Men would have to work six days a week from dawn to dusk, spending their free time living in bunkhouses. Everything from felling the tree to cutting the wood and hauling it was performed by men and horses until machinery became commonplace from around 1945. At this time, hand saws and axes were replaced by chainsaws, and skidders took the job of dragging logs from horses. They would then be arranged on the side of the road for hauling trucks to come and pick up. This new technology meant that fewer men were needed in the forestry industry, but no robot will ever be able to replace these people. They might rely on machinery to speed up their job, but they have the skills and talents necessary to know how to fell trees in the safest way possible, and how to know which trees to fell. You simply can't teach a robot that knowledge. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. Fastest Pizza Box Folder if you've ever visited a pizza joint on a busy Saturday night to order a pizza, you get to see just how fast the employees work. They throw toppings onto bases so quickly that their hands are almost a blur, and they seem to put pizzas in the oven and take them out again as if they're being shot out of a rocket. But what you might also notice is just how quickly they're able to fold pizza boxes. With dozens and dozens of them being needed for an average night of service, you're bound to get quite good at it. But one man is probably a bit better than most. Pizza delivery driver Randy De Gregorio, who works for Mezza Luna Pizza in Manalapan, New Jersey, had spent around five years perfecting the art. He said when business is slow and there aren't any deliveries, he would compete against other drivers to fold pizza boxes the fastest. Then, when he was browsing the internet during one of the pandemic lockdowns, he discovered that there's actually a Guinness Book of World Records category for high-speed pizza box folding. The current world record is held by Venoni of Alessandro, who was able to fold 14 boxes in one minute. That was impressive enough, but Randy was sure he could do better. So Manalapan police officers were there to witness him try. In one minute, he folded 18 boxes, and now it's up to the Guinness Book of World Records judges to confirm his record. Number 18. Fastest Waiter Having a fast waiter in a restaurant is a pleasure for any customer and business owner. They can deliver your food, drinks, and check so quickly that you can be out the door and on your way before you know it. If you know such a waiter, encourage them to vie for the fastest waiter title. In 2019, waiters from eight different Dubai hotels took part in a contest that had them performing many different waiter tasks in a competitive environment. It had been organized by Time Oak Hotels and Suites. Waiters had to balance trays stacked with glasses and run a 720 meter or 0.44 mile course holding the trays with one arm behind their back. Speed was measured, but so was how much water remained in their glasses. Seeing how good they were at balancing made this a must-watch event, and now the waiter's race is an annual event. While robots are waiters in some cafes and restaurants, there's simply no way they'd replace waiters of this caliber. If you were in a hurry to dine and get back to work, you'd definitely call upon any of these waiters race contestants to serve your table. Number 17. Fastest Watermelon Cutter Making fruit salad from scratch can be quite a time-consuming task with so many different fruits to slice, dice, and peel. So maybe you should bring in Matt Jones from Los Angeles, California for the job. Matt holds the world record for the fastest time to dice a watermelon. He broke the previous 25-second record by seconds with a time of 18.19 seconds in 2017. 
Matt performed his wizard magic knife skills on the set of The F Word, which is a British cookery program featuring chef Gordon Ramsay, with recipes and food preparation being the main focus. This knife genius didn't just hack the watermelon into slices, though. He quickly and efficiently cut both ends off, cut off the peel with minimal flesh, then cut the watermelon in half. From here, his knife was basically just a blur as he managed to dissect the watermelon into over 90 pieces skillfully. Millions of people tuned in to watch the live feed, and a Guinness Book of World Records official stood next to Matt to time the world record attempt and inspect the cuts once he had finished. Surprisingly, even after lightning-fast knife work, Matt didn't have a single cut to his fingers. Number 16. Fastest Balloon Animal Maker if there's one thing a robot will never be able to do, it's managing impatient children. When they want something, they often want it now or yesterday. So you have to be quick if you want to avoid a tantrum. You won't have to worry about that happening if you hire magician John Cassidy for your child's birthday. All in attendance can have a balloon animal of their own in just seconds. John is a comedian, magician, and balloon artist with many Guinness World Records under his belt. In 2007, John inflated and sculpted 747 balloons in an hour and created 13 balloon sculptures in just one minute. He's well known for his skills and has appeared on many TV shows like Martha Stewart Living, Late Night with Conan O'Brien, The Today Show on NBC, and he's even performed at the White House. However, he's not the only master of balloons. Ryan Ryan Tracy from London in the UK holds the world record for the fastest time to model five balloon sculptures blindfolded. He was bold enough to attempt this record on the set of Britain's Got Talent. It was his second time trying, and he managed to earn the record in early 2020 by modeling five in 43.64 seconds. Number 15. Fastest Mochi Maker when you own your own food business, you often get pretty quick at preparing different meals. After all, you do it every day, so there will come the time when you don't need a recipe or much time at all. That's definitely true of Mitsui Nakatani, who has been running Nakatani Do, a rice cake shop, for over two decades. He's particularly skilled at making mochi, which is a Japanese rice cake made with short grain japonica glutinous rice. Sometimes it includes other ingredients like sugar, cornstarch, and water. Mochi is a part of traditional Japanese culture, and you'll generally find it at most celebratory events, along with daifuku, which is small mochi with a sweet filling like sweetened red bean paste. But even though it's popular, it is incredibly labor-intensive for the average person. Perhaps not surprisingly, Mitsui has the process down to a fine art. It starts with the polished, glutinous rice being soaked overnight and steamed. Once it's steamed, it's mashed and pounded with mallets in a mortar. Two people then get to work forming the mochi. One will pound with the wooden mallets, while another will wet the mochi. The speed that's required for this process means they must work in unison to avoid the mallet hitting the person wetting the mochi. Once it's ready, it can be eaten straight away or formed into other shapes like cubes and spheres. Number 14. World's Fastest Painter one of the many reasons why original works of art can be so expensive to buy is that they take so much time to paint. Each brushstroke can take a long time to perform, so on top of paying for their reputation, skill, and materials, you're paying for the hours of work that go into each painting. But in the case of Morris Katz, you're definitely not paying for time. Morris isn't as well known as the likes of Picasso, but he should be. The Polish-American man, born in 1932, took up painting as a hobby and worked in the carpentry field. While he started painting with brushes, he soon realized he had more fun with palette knives and rags. So he began creating paintings with wads of tissue paper and palette knives, and at speed. Morris holds the world record for the fastest time to complete a painting. In 1988, he painted a 12 by 16 inch canvas in just 30 seconds with an extra eight seconds to frame it. And the result was beautiful, almost like he had spent hours bringing the art to life. Morris also holds the world record for his sales. He has sold over 225,000 pieces of art, ranging from $7 to $170. One of his pieces also sold in 2014 for $470, showing that the value of his work is possibly going up. Not a bad hourly rate, if you ask me. Number 13. Fastest Dishwasher 
Robots have replaced dishwashers in many situations, but you won't find a single dishwasher machine that could clean dishes as fast as this man, who has been described as the Usain Bolt of dishwashing. It's not known who he is or where he worked, but a video posted online with over 100,000 views shows a man washing 50 plates in 10 seconds without smashing even one. The plates almost look to be a blur as they fly from his hand to the water. They look like they should break, as there's a lot of clattering, but they just don't. Once they're in the water, the man probably gets to work scrubbing them at a much more manageable speed. But commenters were quick to point out that his speed didn't exactly amount to washed dishes. One user wrote that they should do this again with dishes that were used to serve sticky ingredients, like eggs. Others have also asked if they could hire him for Thanksgiving or Christmas. The man hadn't set any kind of world record, but there's probably no reason to believe he can't. Currently, there is a world record for the most dishes washed at one time, which was 23,892. We'd like to see him do that with 23,000 plates without smashing a single one. Number 12. Fastest Shirt Ironing Ask most people and they'll tell you that one of their least favorite jobs is ironing. If that's the case in your household, you might need to get Ben Walton from Andover on the job. Ben holds the official ironing world record and could have your entire family's pile of shirts ironed in just a few seconds. In 2008, Ben spent a whopping 60 hours ironing 923 garments and breaking the world record. In that time, he was only allowed a five minute break once an hour and could accumulate them for a half hour break in total. That's a long time to be ironing garments without long breaks. During the entire process, official adjudicators kept a watchful eye on Ben and the garments to make sure he was ironing them to the highest standard. Once he had finished, he not only had the ironing record in hand, but had raised almost $7,000, which went toward buying an incubator for a hospital in Winchester. Ben clearly has a passion for ironing because in 2012, he got on board with helping to launch the World Ironing Championships, with all entrants being in the running to win money, a title of World Ironing Champion, and a golden Morphe Richards iron. Number 11. Fastest Burger Maker even though robots are more than capable of making burgers with precision and speed, there's one thing they can't do. Make them with love. In Pakistan, you're able to purchase an iconic bun kebab, which looks like a burger, from stall holders who have spent years perfecting their craft and filling the hungry bellies of commuters. As you can imagine, they have kebab bun creation down to a fine art. They can cook ground beef and lentil patties, potato patties, and eggs at great speed, then pair them with chutney, onion rings, lettuce, and tomato inside fluffy, milky buns. The wait time is short, and commuters can watch as their chosen bun kebab cook works at lightning speed to prepare these delicious snacks. One man, Abdul Amin, travels across town in Karachi, Pakistan before the sun rises to set up his push cart in the affluent part of town. When there's enough sunlight, he warms up his cast iron griddle and serves these delicious, hearty breakfast meals in brown paper to those heading off to work. Watch him and others like him work, and you'll be impressed at not only how quickly they can work, but how the end result is always so tidy and delicious. Number 10. World's Fastest Typist in today's digital age, most people who work on computers can type quickly. Even gamers know how to type fast, given how many of their moves require the use of keyboards. But before we had all this remarkable technology, there were still typists who outperformed everyone else. Like Barbara Blackburn, for example. Barbara was such a fast typist that the computers available to her couldn't keep up. She'd type out what she wanted to write and would then have to wait for up to three minutes for the computer to catch up. That was during the 1990s when computers weren't exactly known for their speed and efficiency, but somehow Barbara managed to shine. She held a Guinness World Record for the world's fastest typist and could type 150 words a minute for 50 minutes. Her peak speed was 212 words per minute, which is faster than most people actually speak. 
But whether it makes a difference or not, Barbara wasn't using a QWERTY keyboard like most of us use. Hers had an alternative layout called Dvorak. Instead of starting with Q-W-E-R-T-Y, it had quotation marks followed by the less than and greater than signs, then P, Y, F, G, C, R, and L all along the top row. Number 9. Best Cutting Skills Whenever you're cutting vegetables for a salad or a meal and get into a rhythm, it's hard not to see yourself as a cutting master. But then you see Hiroyuki Torado with a knife, and you realize you got quite a way to go until you're at his level. Using high-quality knives like Kikuichi and Masahiro, Hiroyuki can cut vegetables so thinly that they're almost paper thin. Sure, anyone can do that if they spent seconds on each slice, but this master sushi chef can cut through an onion, cucumber, and other vegetables with absolute speed and precision. And he's definitely well known for it. Hiroyuki is a chef at the Novi Kitchen and Bar in Miami, which is a fast-paced working environment. When you work in a fast-paced business with hungry customers, you have to work quickly. However, there's more to this knife master than meets the eye. Hiroyuki also has a license in Japan to fillet and serve puffer fish, which you know takes incredible skill. If you cut a puffer fish wrong and serve it, your customers can die. Hiroyuki has been using the same knife brand, Kikuichi, for over 20 years. So it's fair to say you get comfortable with the tools you use as well. Number 8. Fastest Pottery Maker In 2016, Joel Cherico was documented setting a new Guinness World Record title for the most pots thrown in an hour. Using a kick wheel, Joel pottered his way to 159 pots in an hour, surpassing the previous record set on an electric wheel with 150 pots. Over 400,000 people watched him break the world record on Facebook, over 70,000 watched on YouTube, and over 300 people watched live. Now, someone else has taken Joel's title, James T. Calhoun. Using an electric wheel, James made 193 pots in an hour in 2018, smashing Joel's record. But what's interesting to note is that the Guinness World Records doesn't have a separate category for electric pottery wheels and kick wheels. You can use whichever one you prefer to set the record. However, it does seem like the record should be split. A kick wheel doesn't use an electric motor and only spins when you kick it. When you're throwing pots and kicking at the same time, this can be incredibly difficult, not to mention labor intensive. Whereas as if you use an electric pottery wheel, it's doing all the spinning for you. Joel actually expressed his opinions online about wishing the records were split, and James responded to his blog post by saying he agreed. Number 7. Fastest Pizza Makers Many families treat themselves on the weekend to a family pizza night. They might order a few pizzas or even more if they have friends over. So you can imagine just how busy pizza joints are on a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. They have to work quickly to keep their customers happy. But some pizza workers are quicker than others. And if you believe you're a fast pizza maker, then maybe you should enter the Domino's World's Fastest Pizza Maker competition. Every two years, some of the quickest pizza makers in the world visit Las Vegas, Nevada to compete in this competition at the Domino's Worldwide Rally. Thousands of spectators turn up to watch the best of the best vie for the title of the world's fastest pizza maker. COVID-19 impacted the 2020 event, but it still went ahead, albeit in a different way. Contestants competed virtually, and a world record was broken. A franchise owner from Canada, Werner Lomker, who is also the 2018 world's fastest pizza maker, won again. He is now a two-time world champion. Werner made three large pizzas in 47.56 seconds, which means each pizza took him only around 15 seconds each. For his efforts, Werner won $3,000, a world champion belt, a trophy, and, of course, the title of world's fastest pizza maker. Number 6. World's Fastest Sheep Shearer now, I've watched people shear sheep in competitions, and it does not look easy. You're bent over, holding a sheep in one hand and clipping it in all different directions with the other. You then have to push the sheep through the door and drag in another, repeating the process hundreds of times. No wonder farmers hire people to do this job for them. But for some people, it's not just a job, it's a hobby and even a career. 
It's definitely the latter if you're the world's fastest sheep shearer. In 2016, Ivan Scott from County Donegal won the world record for the fastest time to shear a sheep, doing it in just 37.9 seconds. He beat the previous record set in Australia in 2010, which was 39.31 seconds. Ivan is clearly no stranger to sheep shearing. He has already won the All-Ireland Sheep Shearing Champion title a whopping eight times and took the record in New Zealand in 2012 for the number of sheep sheared in eight hours. In that competition, he sheared 744 lambs. With this latest record, Guinness World Record adjudicator Glenn Pollard oversaw the attempt with Tom Dunna from the Irish Sheep Shearing Association to ensure the sheep had no cuts or abrasions. Number 5. The Shawarma Master most of us expect fast service when we go to a takeaway restaurant. After all, it's not called fast food for no reason. However, most of us are also aware that some of our food choices do require quite a lot of preparation, like shawarma, for example, which is a popular Levantine Arab dish. As labor-intensive as this food is, one shawarma master makes it look easy. His productivity levels must be through the roof. The man is videoed creating the food inside a restaurant in Russia, and the video clip uploaded to the internet has hundreds of thousands of views. The clip, which is just over a minute long, shows him preparing two wraps at lightning speed before his assistant opens the grill for him to quickly place them inside. He then shows off his knife skills by playing with a large, machete-like knife. This may or may not have added to the appeal, but one commenter said that the machete should be taken out of the performance for safety reasons, even if he really is that good. Knife or no knife, though, you can't deny that you'd choose this guy to serve your food if you were in a hurry. Number 4. Fastest Bartender we already have robots, well, machines, pouring our drinks. You visit your local fast food restaurant and either you or the person serving you can push a button and have a machine fill your cup with your preferred beverage. Some of them even know when to stop, but it could never do it as fast as Eric Mora. As of 2013, he was the Guinness World Record holder for the most cocktails made in an hour. He broke the previous record of 1,003 drinks set two years earlier by Sheldon Wiley with 1,000 559 drinks. Of course, he couldn't just grab a bottle of spirits and pour the same drink over and over again. The record requirements meant that he had to pour drinks that had a minimum of three ingredients, one of which had to be alcohol. He also couldn't repeat any of the cocktails. Helpers supplied him with ice-filled glasses, mixers, and spirits, and Eric got to work pouring one cocktail every two seconds. According to Eric, he had wanted to break it two years earlier, but had only applied in the January before his record-breaking attempt. He said his hard work had paid off, and he feels like he's the world's fastest bartender. Number 3. Fastest Auctioneer when you hear of someone being described as the fastest auctioneer, you might think they talk the fastest or hit their hammer the fastest. That's not entirely true in the case of Hervé Poulain. He's described as being the fastest auctioneer because he's not only a good auctioneer, but a fast racing car driver. He's entered the 24-hour race at Le Mans 11 times and has a passion for both cars and art. Hervé was born in Normandy and started out driving his mother's car as a teenager. He already drove fast at that point, but on ordinary roads. Hervé's brother told him that he drove well and that he should race, so he entered his first race at 28. He also took an interest in historical furniture, and his teachers once told him he spoke well and without nerves about that furniture. They suggested that he train as an auctioneer. So today, he's well known for his driving and auctioneering. He entered the classic car auctioneering business in the early 1970s and would race on weekends in endurance races like Le Mans. Number 2. World's Fastest Haircut I wouldn't imagine too many people would be lining up to get their hair cut by a robot, but they might be lining up to have the world's fastest haircut if they're a little pressed for time on their lunch break. Konstantinos Kutupis from Greece holds the Guinness World Record for the fastest haircut. He broke the record in Athens in early 2017 with a complete haircut performed in just 47.17 seconds. Konstantinos decided to attempt the world record so he could show off his hairdressing talent, and it seems he did just that. 
However, it wasn't long until Konstantinos was going to be sharing the spotlight. A new Guinness World Record holder was named, but for different records. In mid-2018, Ivan Zut, who is described as the Michael Phelps of barbering, broke three records. One for the single fastest haircut, the most professional haircuts in an hour, and the most haircuts in 24 hours. The event took place at Rooster's Men's Grooming Center in Austin, Texas, with the Children with Hair Loss organization to benefit from the event. He broke the record for the single fastest haircut by creating a layered bob in just 55 seconds, beating the previous record of 1 minute 11 seconds. He then broke the record for the most professional haircuts in an hour with 34, which topped the old record of 23. Finally, Ivan worked hard to perform the most haircuts in 24 hours. He succeeded with 300 haircuts. Number 1. Fastest Taxi Driver When you're running late for an appointment and rely on public transport to get around in Germany, there's only one man you'll want to call. Daniel Wolfs. He has Germany's fastest taxi, and you're going to feel like you're in a racing car while you're heading to your destination. Daniel operates a Mercedes MC660 with 660 horsepower and a V8 engine in Recklinghausen, Germany, and it turns heads everywhere he goes. It looks like any other taxi with its yellow taxi sign and ivory paint scheme, but there's no denying it's not like any other taxi. It can reach speeds of over 200 miles an hour, and customers frequently get to experience that. After all, Germany's autobahns are pretty flexible with speed limits. Daniel tends to operate his Mercedes Mercedes taxi on weekend nights and has other unique vehicles in his fleet. He also drives a Hummer, convertible taxi, and stretch limousine. Daniel says he's always looking online for rare cars, and the Mercedes was his most recent purchase. What surprises people the most when they get into Daniel's taxis is how affordable the service is. His rates are the same as others, which means he gets a lot of requests for service. Daniel also says people underestimate the Mercedes power, and he's had to wipe pizza grease and and other food off the windows from people holding food who didn't quite believe him. I suppose when you do something enough, you get pretty fast at it. Sure, fast doesn't always equal good, but you sure do learn to be precise with enough practice. For example, anyone that types for a living can hit the right keys every time without looking. What do you do so often that you now think a robot could never replace you? Let us know in the comments. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!